Hey guys, what's happening? Just about to finish No Eat Clue and I've got a puzzle casket and I've got a Celtic knot. So I thought I'd give you all a quick tutorial on how to quick tutorial on how to do them because a lot of people I know do struggle with Celtic knots and do buy the puzzle skipping tickets. Now there's no point in buying the puzzle skipping tickets. You can get these knots done in about a minute. So you're wasting your money if you're buying the skipping tickets and you're dropping down the result of the clue reward as well. So let's get to it. So simple as hell. Seriously, once you know how to do these properly, they are like the easiest things and they are quite fun. I really enjoy these knots. I really do. So pick two. I usually go for red and green. So you just pick two and focus on them too. Right, so let's go for red and green. Yeah. So as we see here, we've got an astral here, a body rune there on red. So we'll just keep turning green until we can see them. So can we see an astral and a body in that order on the green? Personally, no, I can't see it. So what we'll do is we'll move the red one. And now we've got, I can't think even know what that is. Mud rune, is it? And a soul rune. So we have a look for that. And um, we haven't got that either. Nope. So we'll turn the red another one. And we'll have a look for this, steam rune and air rune. Oh, we haven't got that either. <laughs> Not in that order anyway. So, did it, let me have a look. Did it, did it, nope. So we'll move the red another one. Now we've got a nature rune and a steam rune again. Mist rune, steam rune, whatever they are. Does anyone ever use them? No. Do we need to know what they are? No. So we do have them in order here. So as you can see, we've got nature here. And we have mist steam, whatever it is there. So let's put them into place. Du, du, du. Nope. As you can see, the other two intersections where red and green join, they're not they're not lit up. So that's obviously not the correct thing. So we'll look for the other one. So move red again, and we're going for mind and body this time. Now we do have mind and body one apart, however, it's in completely the wrong order. So we'll move red again. We've got lava and mud. I think that's mud. There's no lava runes on green that I can see, so we'll skip red again. And we've got steam rune and astral rune. Do we have an astral rune on green? Do we? I don't think we do. No. So we'll skip red again. Earth and whatever that is again. Da, 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 da. I don't think we have any earth runes. That's crazy. Oh yes we do, there's an earth rune. But is it joint with a mud rune? No, it's not. So we'll skip that again, red. And what you gotta do is just keep doing this until you find it. Now I'm doing it slowly so that you can see, but usually I would do it ridiculously fast. Da, 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 water and steam, let's have a look. There's no water runes on green, is there? No, no water runes, weird. Okay, so we've got steam and nature rune. Now I've had this before, so we know it fits, but it doesn't fit, <laughs> as you can see, so they're not lit up, so it sucks. Now it will get annoying like that, but you can get these done really quickly, like I said. You just gotta know how to do them properly, and this is the proper way to do them, so. Just do this method and you'll be fine. So we've got mind and body and mind and body fit. So let's put them into place. And yes, there we go. So we've got all red and green ones. All red and green intersections are lit up. So now we just slide around the blue until it fits. So there's the mud rune there. There you go. They're all lit up. Unlock. And there's your treasure. And I got 200k, which is standard for elite. But, you know, oh well. But yeah, that's how to do the Celtic knot puzzles. So thank you very much for watching and peace out.